Bay Park. Toowoom Bay is just below the entrance on the central coast. I believe it's about a five minute drive, so pretty central. If you're staying here and you're in a motorhome or a caravan and you want a nice view, I recommend the site that I'm on, 324 or site 288. They're both level and they offer probably the best views in terms of powered campsites. If you're coming in a tent and you want a nice view, I recommend 330 to 332. They're not level and they're not very accessible for a caravan or a motorhome, so just be mindful. I recommend just tent or you know a car set up for those sites. 318 and 319 also offer good views, but they're not level, so just be mindful. If you don't mind that, they're accessible with a caravan or a motorhome, those ones. If you're after an ensuite site, I recommend E1, that's the best site. It's fully level, it's close to the beach access, and it does offer some views from that site. But if you can't get that one, any of those ensuite sites in that block are quite good as well. If you're coming with kids, this holiday park is great. It offers a pool, jumping pillow, kids play area, also offers a camp kitchen in there. If you're after a site which is quite central for that, I recommend 214 to 219 if you're coming in a tent type setup. If you're coming in a caravan or motorhome, I recommend the sites 249 to 260 if you want something central. 207 to 212 are level sites as well and they overlook the pool. They also offer drive-through sites here. Just be mindful that they're not level, but they are centrally located to the camp kitchen pool, jumping pillow and all of that, if that's what you're after. There's a range of cabins here, some with views, some without, and they have direct beach access as well to some of those. So they're really, really nice. In terms of location, Toon Bay is a sort of sleepy coastal town, but it's not too far from anything. You've got holes not too far away and a big shopping center there. You've also got the entrance, which is a five minute drive. So everything's quite convenient here, but you don't have the hustle and bustle of sort of like the entrance, all those type places. You've got Long Jetty, which is a, maybe about a 15 minute walk, two minute drive, which would be really good on sunset. So they've got a nice jetty there, which heaps of photographers go and take photos of. So if you're after a nice sunset drink, head down to Long Jetty and sit by the water there. In terms of dog friendly beaches, there is a dog friendly beach, but it's south of Toon Bay Beach. So it's just literally behind me here on site 324. And there's a really cool little swimming spot we found yesterday on low tide. So highly recommend going there. It's super calm, uh, beautiful, clear water. So definitely get down there on low tide. So I really like this caravan park. It's got everything here. It's kid friendly, it's dog friendly, it's just awesome. Good views and all of that, so highly, highly recommend coming here. And yeah, if you can, get one of the sites with the views. If not, you should be happy with most sites here. They're generally all level, give or take, you know, a chock or two, but yeah, super happy. We'll be back here. Highly recommend coming here, you won't be disappointed.